Hello everyone, my name is Priya Probst and I like to present our paper Camera Distances and Shot Sizes in Cinematic Virtual Reality. Cinematic Virtual Reality or Short CVR is basically a movie in VR. So the viewer gets a 360 degree view of the scene. But compared to other VR applications, the viewer is very limited in his interaction. So for example, he cannot walk around the room or grab objects. He can only choose his viewing direction. In traditional movie, the film gets protected on a rectangle, but in CVR, it gets protected on a sphere. So the viewer gets the impression of depth and space. Therefore, we need to reconsider some stylistic tools of film narration. For example, um, framing or in detail shot sizes. Shot sizes are a very important tool for cinematic narration because it can be used to convey emotional information. They are determined by the camera distance. So in traditional movies, um, they're only a part of the body of the actors are shown. For example, in, in an extreme close-up, only the eyes. But in CVR, the viewer always sees the whole body of the actor and he gets a very good understanding where the actor is placed in the room and in which distance to him. Proxemics is a psychological field which describes the social and personal space and how people perceive them. So that means that people communicate through their placement and space and through their um, choice of distance to each other. So for example, a friend would always keep a closer distance to you than a stranger. So it is very strongly context driven. Um, some influences can be the height, the gender, and the culture of a person. E.T. Hall defined four different proxemic zones, the intimate space, the personal space, the social space, and the public space. We use these four proxemic spaces in our user study for the independent variable, which was the camera distance. These uh, distances you can see in the left rectangle. In our user study, we showed a movie to 24 participants. In the movie, um, an actor gave a museum's tour. In each scene, the actor was placed on a di different camera distance. So it was the user we used uh, within the subject design for the user study. Um, so each participant got to see the same movie and all variations of the independent variable. After they saw the movie, they were asked to um, fill out a questionnaire with questions um, about our dependent variable variables, which were the presence, the attention, the social presence, and the user study, user experience, which was most important to us. The results show that different camera distances produce different sensations in the viewer. So for example, for our closest distance, which was on 0.45 meters, the viewer felt very intrusive and it created a lot of discomfort. One meter felt the most natural and pleasant for the viewers and five meters less, less exciting. For the social presence, we found out that the participants had a more intense feeling on the intimate and the personal distance that the person in the video was looking at them and talking to them. In conclusion, we can say that the camera that camera distances in CVR can be used in a similar way as shot sizes because you can use it them to convey emotional information. So for example, for the intimate distance, you can use it similar as a close up and the personal distance, you can use it similar as a, similar as a medium shot, etc. What I found interesting what was what one participant said, um, he had the feeling that on the personal distance, he was given something like a VIP tour and the um, actor was only talking to him. But on the 
social distance, he had the feeling that he was part of a group and the actor was talking to a tourist group or something. So I hope it was interesting for you and thank you for listening. If you have questions, don't hesitate to contact us.